Alright, what's going on YouTube? Just want to document our Lego city here. And before we started filming, we had a little accident. In my Joker steam wheeler, or steam roller, whatever it's called. It was sitting up here. It just crashed on us. So I gotta put that back together. There's my collection of Batmobiles. Right now I have two trains going. High speed passenger train. And I motorized the tram. Put some lights on it. I mean, it's kind of crude. Like it will fall apart in any moment, but it does what it do. So the purpose of this video is to document city layouts and get some feedback on what works, what doesn't work. Yeah, that's it, and that doesn't work. So, right there, we had a little collision just now. Hi, world! <laughs> and that's my baby girl, Eden. Where's the remote? Is this it or that it? It's that one. Over here, I have a friend's cafe corner. I'm not nearly done with that. This is my, this is something I've started. This is from uh, Brick City Depot. Uh, hope to have that done in the near future. My row of apartments from the pet shop. That is my favorite. I hope to have a couple more of those. I don't think that's on all the way, baby. Got the Simpsons house back there. Got the Haunted Mansion. Ghostbusters. Got the Ghostbusters. Uh, what's that? The Ecto... The new Ecto one, and that's... The old one. The old one. I'm gonna put this right here. Got the brick bank. Make it another brick bank and put it right over there. And then move the... That's the Parisian restaurant. Relocate that. So back there, that's the San Blue Green Grocer. The extra level. I'm nearly done with that. I did take uh, San Green bricks and converted the pet shop. This is the new, newest modular, the Assembly Square, which I love. Oh, yeah, we'll come back to the green pet shop at the end. Got two grand emporiums. Uh, right here we have a little park scene. And you'll notice that I like to have flesh colored Lego in my city. So I remove all the yellow. I think it just looks better. Bark, bark. Bark, bark. Got Fred and Daphne in the Mr. Machine down there. And there's some um, um, Velma. 
Palace Cinema. That's the Palace Cinema. And then we have the pet shop. We got the zoom in there. Hey, there's the um, bathroom. Uh-huh, it's like a porta john that came with one of the sets. It's called a party. It's called food party. That's the Arkham Asylum. We're going to find a spot for that. Then all of these uh, micro racers. I love it. And I have okay. the whole collection, but I haven't put them together yet. i got to find a spot for them. Uh, that's the fire brigade there. That's the first modular that I got. Just lucky to get that before it was retired back in uh, 2013, somewhere around there. Town Hall. And like I said, a Parisian restaurant. And that's the front side of my blue green grocery. And then we have the detective office. Right there. Then over here, that's where I'm almost done. I got a few Brickling orders coming. This is where Market Street will go. Market Street. Nearly good. done with. Um, Green grocer. Those uh, one by two groove bricks, they're Oops. nearly four dollars a piece now. Oh. Glad I got them. Like they were a little cheaper when I got them, maybe two fifty. I don't know, somewhere around there. And then lastly, Cafe Corner, which got a <laughs> you know, I got a lot of things that are just halfway done. Yeah. This old man up there chilling, reading school the paper. Man. Oh. I said, old man. Oh, I thought you said school man. Yeah. The invisible jet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a Lego city. Just let me know what you think. Subscribe and like and comment. That's right. Subscribe, like, comment. And at the end, I'll show you uh, what I'm working on with Keep the, noise. the green pet shop. Okay, so what we've done is we've added some LED lights from uh, BrickLoot.com, and this is the cheapest option that I can find is for both the lamp and there's four lights within our green pet shop we call it Eats uh, that ran me about 16 bucks with, with shipping so let me know what y'all think about that what I was trying to do is my plan is eventually to light my whole city with other those lights from Brick Loot. There's also uh, LightMyBricks.com. I've been looking at those, and when I first started, like I said back in 2013. I got the bug for these modular buildings and I bought a bunch of lights from lifelights.com and I guess I'm not smart enough to <laughs> hook those up because I just couldn't get it right. That entailed, you know, the wires on that. Let me do a, like a mini review on them later. But the wires are kind of thick, 
So you have to elevate your city a little bit. That just seemed too time consuming and I'm gonna do something else. So let me turn the lights out here. <laughs> Uh, let this thing focus. Is it going to focus? Oh, you ain't trying to focus. Oh, there we go. Oh, cool. It's like, like, water. <gasps> All right, so there it is. And then you could turn that thing on, and then the other one, and then they can go, like, around the street. Yeah, those are the lights to the That's train. Cool. It should be still on. Yeah. We can knock. You can barely see the lights. This Those is are, of bright. course, from Lego. Do the other ones have lights? Like when, if you make a movie and then. No, baby girl. This is the only one that has lights right now. Like I said, uh, my plan is to eventually have the whole city lit up. But yeah, let me know if, if you think that's too bright or maybe I need like a softer light. I think it looks pretty cool. Write it down in the comments and subscribe and like. Right on. Alright, that's it. Peace.